Hello everybody, we're full back with Majora's Mask. In the last episode, we did uh, we did actually did a lot. We um, we got a horse, as you guys can see. Um, we did the Goron race, got rid of our sword, and uh, that's pretty much it. Well, oh, what else we did? Oh, we got the powder keg. We blew up uh, the ro the rock that was blocking this road. So that's that's something. All right, milk road. But I think we're also we're actually gonna head off to over here. Oh jeez, the Gorman track. It's, oh my God, there are two Luigi's guys. Let's go talk to Luigi by the gate. It's a pathetic thing of your horse. I just changed accents like that. I would have guessed that little thing was a mule for sure. Ain't that right, little brother? Do you think uh, the, do you think a horse that pathetic would gallop if you pushed the control stick forward, or would it run faster if you pressed A? This guy, why don't you give us ten rupees for the chance to race against us? If you win, we'll give you something nice, kid. Uh, I don't even know how many rupees I have. So it's a race. Ah, yeah, are you ready? I don't know how many rupees I have. I don't think I don't even think I have enough to uh, pay for another race if I lose. So, and we're off. Hey, I think that looks like a mule rather than my horse. I mean, I have a baby horse, but you know, hey, it's not a mule. So just stay around the outside, and we should be fine. And uh, yeah, just stay around the, uh, outside uh, to give you leverage. You should be fine. Leverage? No. Do I get, do I get, oh, why do you stop? Oh, I got no rupees for this. Okay. I can see, it takes, takes a while. Oh, crap, give me carrots, give me carrots. What the heck? I just like randomly ran out of carrots right there. I can stand by this, you get a little speed boost, which is always kind of helpful. Oh my God, please. Come on, Epona. Come in clutch with me right here, sweetheart. Shit, I lost. That was embarrassing. But that was awful. Holy shit. I didn't think I have enough to even race again. Oh, jeez. What a way to start the video. No, I don't have enough. I don't have enough rupees. Alright, so I'll go get some more rupees. I'll meet you guys back. I got the W this time. Eat it, losers. <laughs> I can't believe I lost. Look at his legs just like spazzing out. Big bro, I wonder if we can give it up to this guy. We got to give him something. Yeah, well, he's a kid, so that could he. So what could he do with it? It should be fine. And we got the Goro's Mask. I don't know why the other to it. The Goro's Mask. In exchange, you can't tell anyone where you got this. So, I think we'll try to figure out what the... You know what? No. I'll save it for the next part. Um, as you can see, um, I'm actually going to wait until midnight and go versus um, creepy little alien dudes. So, yeah, I'll teleport to uh, nighttime and we go uh, fight them. Well, it's, uh, nighttime, but, yeah, I'll just... I'll be ready. And they better bring it. At 2 o'clock in the morning? Why would aliens come here at 2 o'clock in the morning? Especially for cows. They're just stupid cows. Alright, so. Park it. The barn's actually right here, so we're gonna be protecting this right here from alien invaders. So. We actually, in fact, know a song to help us... I uh, get through it. It's the um, song of double time, which is is right, right, a a down, down. So there you go. To the night of the first day. Yes, we will do that. And then for the time being, from there, we'll just um. Oh, he knocked me down. We'll just wait until the aliens arrive. Okay, cool, got it. So now we'll just wait for the aliens to arrive. All right, jeez, it's almost time. It's almost time. Give me those aliens. I'll kick their ass any day of the week. Got my arrow ready. 
He probably can scare him off too. As I hope. Where are they? Where are they? Here we go. And it's almost time. About time right now. Two o'clock. There she is. She's ready. Where are you going? Where are you going? Uh oh. Uh oh. Um. This is a practical joke, isn't it? Isn't it? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This, uh... Oh, jeez. Uh-oh. Protect thy cows! Puppy, help me! Oh, Jeez. All right. Whoa. Oh, wow, they are really getting close. You don't stand a chance, Mr. Ghost. What? What? Okay, so this really isn't that tough. Just gotta shoot him. Pay attention to the one in the back. He put a duck. Good job, put away the duck for me. Holy crap, I am really starting to run low on uh, arrows. This is really not good. So, um. So, what do I do? Oh, jeez. I run out of arrows. I never thought about this. I think she said like if you I think if like you read um if you go see her when she goes into the barn she says like if you if you hit the box that's how you get arrows, I hope. But I think I should be alright because the sun's really starting to come up right now. I hope I can hold them off. Oh shit, definitely a lot more arrows. Leave me alone. And leave the cows alone. Oh, yep, they're down. We did it! We saved the little girl! And the cows! Hooray! What do we get from saving the cows? We did, we won! Thank you! Thanks to you, the cows are giving thanks to you! Give it thanks too. Here's your money. Thanks. When you drink it, put your hand on your hip and take a big gulp like we did here at the ranch. And we get another bottle, and this time we get milk in it. So this recovers five hearts per gulp. This bottle contains two gulps. When it's empty, recycle the bottle. Be kind. It's almost time for my sister to get up, so I have to get back to bed. See you later, little hero. And we saved her and we got another bottle. And it's almost sunrise, so I say let's head off to Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Poto, you gotta stay here a little bit longer. Hopefully they don't put you back in the cage of doom. So yeah, we're actually heading off because it's almost sunrise, and in the last part, we went to go see um that dude to uh to give him our sword, and hopefully our sword will be ready to go. The moon looks terrifying right there. So it's almost time, and damn it. I was trying to attack these snow piles and I realized I don't have my sword. It will be amazing to get my sword back. Uh oh. Oh no! The screen! It's getting smaller. Oh! Can I, pick, can I pick these up? I can! Alright, screw the sword. I right, got some health out of it. Sweet! Uh, that's the sound of the Bee of Doom. There's the Bee of Doom. Bees, you shouldn't even be out yet. It's way too dark out for you guys. And up, uh, the dawn of the second day, 48 hours remaining. And is that what the fire looks like coming out of the house? Holy crap, that looks awful. 
And now, since it is dawn of the, the, the second day, don't know my numbers anymore, we shall go open the door and get our sword back. What? I kept you waiting, but it's done. See? We got the Razor Sword! As you guys, as you guys know, he said, uh, This new sharper blade is a cut above the rest. Use it up to a hundred times without dulling its superior edge. Now, keep in mind that after... Okay, he says that all the time. But, we got some gold dust. He said something about gold dust. But we do have gold dust. So... Hey, dude. Oh, customer! Gabora, fetch our customer some coffee, quick like. Now then, let me take a look at that sword of yours. Hmm. Hey, now, it's a mean joke. Your sword has already been reforged into a razor sword. Unless... Do you want me to make your stro sword stronger? To do that, I'll need gold dust. Do you have any? Indeed I do. Press the start menu, which is actually really helpful, to open it up, and we do have some gold dust. No, hold on, let's put this to look over here. And BAM, here you go. Why, if it isn't gold dust, and it's even top quality! Why, even if I use it to reforge your sword, there'll still be more some left. Alright, just for you, I'll do this for free. But don't tell anyone. Thanks for dropping in. Now then, I'm straight off to work. Come back tomorrow morning. <laughs> so, he says tomorrow morning we'll go get a better sword. I trust the sword building. Sorry about that. And, um, I'm actually going to teleport to, to the morning of the third day to get the sword. Because I want to show you guys it and then I'm going to end my part off there. Because I, I apologize this part isn't going to be that long. Because, for whatever reason... I've been like, making a really long part today, and uh, I was about to go destroy some stuff with my sword, but then again, I don't have my sword again. Uh, so I'll meet you guys on the dawn of the third day. The final day, 24 hours remain. And the shitty fire quality, oh, that was awful. So hold on a hot second. I gotta s slow it on time because I don't trust my ability. Because I I remember there is one more thing I think I want to do before we tackle what I want to do next. Well, before I end the part because there's something we can do. I kept you waiting, but it's done. See, we got the gilded sword. Newly forged, your sword is better than ever. It will break. Never. It will never break. Blech. There it is. We can't make a sword stronger than that. No matter how many times you use it, it will never lose its edge. Try it. Oh, I used most of most of the gold dust. Just a tiny bit was left, so I got rid of it for you. Dude, look how creepy he looks. Jesus Christ, where the hell did they find that guy? Anyway, we're actually gonna. Oh, hold on. I want to kill an enemy with my sword because swords are better now. Swords are swords are better now. Great grammar you know, for die base. I mean that that doesn't that doesn't show much because it's a damn B, but um, spin attack. See, we destroyed all of that grass in one go. Shout out to the gilded sword. But I'm actually gonna head off to Clock Town real quick, so because there is something we gotta do there. So I will meet you guys back at Clock Town. All right. Well, I sadly do not believe I have enough time to go to Clock Town and do what I want to do. So that I'll do. I'll just do it in the next part. In the next part of Majora's Mask, we will figure out what we need to do next in the game. So, if you guys like the video, subscribe to the comment. I'll see you guys next time. See you guys then. I have one note with the Gilded Sword. Uh, once you go back in time to the first day, you actually still have the sword, which is actually really cool. So yeah, that's a little note for you guys. So yeah. Oh my god, Earthquake!